Hey Ozzy here, in this video I'm just going to talk about like how we can create this type of animation on Figma. Uh, I mean if you not understand let me tell you. When I just click on here this menu bar, it just opens the sidebar, side menu that you call. So when I click on here the blank space, it's automatically gone. Again I click on here, I get the menu bar, again I click on here, it just gone. So how we can do this? It's quite easy work, not something hard. Let me show you. So as you can see, I already designed here this two page. I already have some of the other. Um, but if you don't know how to create, uh, how to design this, then just let me know in comment. I will I will create a different video for you. But now mainly we're talking about the maneuver. So so now we have to just click on here this prototype. So when you click on the prototype, then you will get to see every her its option like in a you know something like circle this type of option. So normally in design, we are not getting to see this type of circle, but when you click on this prototype, we get here the circle. So mainly it just kind of like drag and drop. We can do it manually, for example, when I click on here, I get option interaction. When I click on, then I go to see tab none. So when I click on tab, I get to see like tab and few more other things like on drag, while hovering, pressing, key and gamepad, like some more. So mainly we just need the tab. So here it's when someone just tab what happened mainly it just open an overlay and where this overlay gonna happen like which piece uh, which piece will be overlay so you have to choose here but I'm not going to use this option you know I'm not going to follow this it's having a quick and easiest way that is like if you just hover in here the circle you get to see in a plus icon just drag and drop here then you will get to see it's showing on drag. So it's mainly the on drag it's automatically choose and it's not, um, you can't select here uh, into, um, you know, other. It's have the problem I faced few minutes ago, but now I'm just going to choose, uh, okay, so let me just remove here all. And now I'm just going to drag and drop here. So I get to see here on top, on tab, navigate to this page and I have to choose this overlay. So when I choose overlay, I get to see here some of the option like in overlay, top left or top uh, corner, bottom left, what you really want. So I just choose here top left and also it's having, a, it's having an option like it's showing that, you know, this um, how it would be, right? So this is mainly the minimal, that's why I choose the middle one, like this one, and also it's some, some option, you will get to see like this is unchecked, but I just tick mark on here, like the first one, close when click outside. You know, in video, you on starting the video, you get to see like when I just click on outside, it just automatically close, so it's gonna happen. And also the add background, so if I not create any kind of background, it's look like, okay, we, people can not understand, and it's not like look like realistic, that's why I just turn on here this video. I mean the background um, here so you can choose here the color if you want and here is this opacity how much you do you really want and here's the animation you get to see the preview so in animation I just choose here moving it's have also instant and dissolve and here's the direction how do you really want so if you change it to then you get to see here the different animation right I mean when I change the direction I just go here and over it I get to see the preview so I like I like this one. So it just look like this. And here is the other option like is out and is in like this. So if you want to change anything then you can do it here. And here the milliseconds it's 300 so I'm not going to change it and I'm just going to close it from here. So now if I just go back again the page, uh, mainly you have to just click on here and just go to here this play icon the present then this page, uh, you know, the page will be coming here and you get to see the preview. So if I click on here, now I'm currently getting to see the changes that I do right now. And if I again want to change anything, if I click on hit the button, I get to see here tab and slide menu, just click on here. Then you get to see here all the options, like I'm just going to make it red, close it, let's come back again here. So as you can see, when I change it to red, it still look like red. So it's totally up to you, right? And if I not choose here this, then you're gonna see, okay, it's not really working. You know, it's not closing anywhere. It's not going anywhere. So uh, make sure that you choose it. 
Okay, so guys, I hope you understand. If you really like this video, please click on this like button. And if you're new here in my channel, if you like design, then you can do subscribe, no worries. And also, if you don't know like how to design this type of pages, then please let me know in comment. I will try to make some different video about that, how to create um, this type of UI. Thank you so much.